Hello everyone, and welcome to my ninth Pokemon Battle Revolution battle on Wi-Fi. Very tense, gets very tense towards the end of this battle. It's it's nice. Let's get the Japanese trailer. Yeah, so she leaves with the frost loss. Now I'll go with my good little crowbat. I love my crowbat. Of course. Frost loss being the ice. Crowbat's not gonna do anything, is it? I'd be stupid to leave it out. I was pretty high speed. I went for the U-turn. Let's get some initial damage in. Which is quite a good start. But there you go, our U-turn. Of course, it's not very effective. And Crowbat comes back to me. Oh yes. So here I go with my Tyranitar. It's the one that would have resisted the oncoming ice attack best. And yeah, of course, Frostlash uses Ice Beam, as I predicted. And my Tyranitar takes that quite well. So yeah, I was thinking about the switches here in the next turn. So I just thought I'd go for the Crunch. It's a stab move, so I'll get more damage on than anything else. It's the most accurate stab move I've got, the other being Stone Age. So yeah, it's the best one I had, so I just thought I'd go for it. And if he stays in, I'll get double damage. But of course, he doesn't stay in, or she. I'm saying he when it's she. <laughs> yeah, lol at me. Okay. She switches to Charizard. And I crunch. I crunch away. And yeah. There's quite a good lot of damage there. Nice. So now, here I was expecting an earthquake. So I went in for Crobat. But this was really, really lucky. I'm glad I didn't go in for the Swamp Earth. Because I wouldn't have pulverised my Swamp Earth. Because this young lady, she goes all out with her Charizard. And she was a Solar Beam. Which is very good. Look at how little damage it does to my crow back there. Now I've got a slight dish advantage because of the sandstorm, which was set up by my tower and sand sandstream. So a slight disadvantage there. But it's not that good. Oh, whatever. Yeah, so I'll try to set up with the toxic here. But unfortunately, it does miss. Which is not what I wanted. Because I was trying to set up with the Toxic just in case that I didn't any moves that would actually take me out. Because my other two put are quite really weak to this Charizard. So the S Slash doesn't take my Crobat out, which is great! Yeah, my Crobat here is it up with the Citrus Berry. And the Sandstorm goes and takes some health. Chipping it away. Yeah, so I thought, oh, what the hell, I can't be bothered with. Moves missing now. It's too risky. So just went in with the air slash. Which is great. Because it gets the Charizard out with the Sandstorm effect. Sandstorm. Because it leaves us it leaves the Charizard with only a little bit left. Fatly one. The Charizard uses flame throw it, stab move, and takes my crowbat out. But then Sandstorm takes Charizard out for me which is really really great and the next turn is where she sends uh, Govwa out I'll go back to Tyranitar Ty 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 I want to keep me swamp but it's a surprise for the end she provides a tense battle with the frost lass yeah so I some send my Tyranitar out here. She goes with her God War. Oh yes. And what this God War does I totally was not expecting. I'll go in the, with the crunch which will be super effective. But then Damn and Blast! 
bitch. Destiny Bond. Damn. Totally was not expecting that. So I'll take a ground fire with a crunch. But the Destiny Bond ended up taking me tire on tire out. Which would have proved useful for a frost lass. Which was what I was planning. But yeah, Destiny Bond just went whoosh. And then damn, I just died with God War. Because God War just wanted Tyrant to die. Because God War's like that. Yeah, so here comes Swampert. It's the tense battle. Tense battle between Swampert and Frostlass. Because I'm going to go in for an earthquake. Surf won't do anything, Ice Beam won't do anything, and there's no use using Protect because I've just got to get this Frostlass out. So yeah, Earthquake, come on. First I'll set up a heal, change it in beneficial weather conditions for her. Earthquake almost takes Frostless out. I was thinking, God, God, what the hell? I hope this next attack leaves me in. Please leave me in. Please leave me in. Yeah, just, honestly. This was really good. Blizzard, right? I thought, oh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. But look, I didn't die. Yes, I don't die. So yeah, I'm quick. I'm BAM! Bye bye, Frostlass. You got nowhere to go. It's the end of the road for you. And I've won! I've won. Thought I wasn't gonna win that was at the start before I started the battle, but yeah. I win, and that was a good win, so yeah, thanks for watching, comment, rate, subscribe, whatever you want.